welcome back guys so basically we're going to um show you guys how to make walnut milk today simple i'm not gonna add anything to it i'm gonna i want to do it naturally um yeah that's what i want to do i want to do it naturally as you guys can see how i do it okay So if you're a person who can drink milk, this is going to be healthy for you. And also you can use it in your coffee. You can do a lot of stuff with it. All right. So if you are, if you are interested, just sit back, relax, and watch the full episode. How to make the walnuts milk. All right. Come on guys, please share the video. Don't be shy. Sit back and just a look. You know what I mean? Yeah, share the video. And you know, tell a friend. And a friend, tell a friend. Yeah. Yeah man, tell a friend and a friend, tell a friend. Please like the video also. And please share the video because this is a very interesting video for a lot of you guys. Just to um to see exactly what Chef Ricardo have been doing. I'm just waiting for at least 15 likes on the video. Then we can start the show. I wanna make a small video type to show you something today. Alright? Yeah. 15 likes. Come on guys. We got 11. Let's get the other rest. Let's get the other rest, guys. My God. Okay. All right. 12. Yeah, let's get the other rest. Let's get in arrest. 13, 14, 15. Nicole, good morning. Thank you so much, man. Nice to see you coming on the show. Yeah, the rest of people, I'm shy. They don't want to say anything. Anyway, let's go on. Let's go ahead and, and do the show. Because the rest of people, I'm not going to say anything. They're very shy. All right. All right. Big up on yourself. See how we No, no, no feelings. Everything is good. Alright. Um 786, big up yourself. Yeah man. Alright, let's go. So right here, this is the walnuts right here. So I've been soaking it overnight. Okay. So you have to soak it overnight. And then what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna strain it off. Okay? And wash it off after. Yeah. Oh, you love coconut milk. Um, oh. All right, big up yourself. So what we're going to do, I'm going to strain it off and wash it off. Okay, so let's do that right now. God. Yeah, lovely. So here it is. So... So I strain it off and I wash it off, okay? Strain off it and then I just rinse it off with some water. Beautiful. All right. Got your guys. Now I'm going good enough. So, so what we're going to do, we're going to put it into this blender right here, okay? Yeah, man, it's a good vibes. So, in the blender, just like this, okay? Yeah, that are going are good vibes. Uh, I think you guys are very shy today. Yeah, man. All right, now, the 
longer you blend it, it's gonna be much better. Okay? Let me rinse off this. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna add some water to it. Okay, here it is. We're going to add some water to it. Same amount of water, same amount of ingredients. So basically, the walnuts is just a pack of walnuts I'm using. Okay, just to make. You might, you might have wondered how much walnuts. So roughly about, about one and a half cups of walnuts I'm using. Yeah. All right. So you don't want to put too much water in it, guys. You don't want to spoil it. So we're going to put... So when you want to make something at home and you don't want to spoil it, you put the same amount of ingredients with the same amount of water. I don't know if that makes sense to you. So same amount of ingredients, same amount of water inside of it. Okay, lovely. You can put honey inside of it if you want a sweet milk. You can put some dates inside of it, but I just want to keep it naturally. And then... Here it is. So this is how it looks. So we're going to blend it up now, okay? Yeah, man. Good vibes. Let's blend him up and strain it. So we're gonna run it through the strainer. Yeah. All right. We're gonna run it through the strainer. The longer you blend it, it's gonna be much better for you. because I don't have one of those um, we call it let's put a little bit of water into this and let's rinse dot and put it on it so you know yeah because this blender is a is a bullet so all right so that's the way it look right there so we're gonna get that milk out through the strainer you don't know don't, you just because i don't have one of those um we call it one of those little uh like it's like a tummy they just can put it in it and squeeze it out i need to get one of them but i'm running it through my strainer all right Yeah, I know. I don't have one of those one. That's what I need. But 
what I'm gonna do with it is fine because you know I know exactly what I don't have one of those um I went to get one but they didn't have it so I just have to use what I have all right just rinse out the blender so I don't mind it my won't be like this if you guys can um run it through that strainer Yeah. Yeah, man. A good vibes. Yeah. Yeah. I don't have one of them. I went to get one, but then didn't have it. So I said, "Chow." I'm gonna have to just use what I have. All right. Yeah. So, that looking good. Yeah, man. That looking really rich and nice. Okay? You see that? Look at that. All right? Yeah, man. This more rich and nice. So you want you have one of those like a if I have one of those cloth I just put it into it and squeeze it out but I don't have it so I'm a person I just use strainer all the time um, also you can run it to a finer strainer like this if you like to okay yeah man so if say if I did want to um, run it through my finer strainer like this one okay and then it's gonna get even more thinner okay like this but all right so this is a proper strainer right here but this one is a very smaller one so you can see it's a little bit much much more better through that finer strainer all right yeah look at this now let me show you where i go on the car this as trainer and then we are good to go because it's not something we normally make on a regular basic but yeah but look at this but this is trainer and a powerful strainer This guys, you don't have to throw away this now. You can use it in smoothie and a lot more stuff, okay? You don't have to pour it away. You can also reuse it in different ingredients, you know? Hope you guys are seeing exactly what Chef Ricardo I do. Yeah, it look like about half cup. I'm going to get out of it. guys so I don't want to use too much water and I because now I'm going to rich and nice
See that? Yeah, man. A good vibes. Right, that's up. Yeah. So as you can see, exactly things uh, because I don't have a proper strainer. I only have that small strainer. All right, because it's not something more me I do every day. But here it is. Look for yourself. Yeah, man. Look for yourself, guys. Honestly. See that? All right. I hit this. Look at that. Okay. Now, you can do the same thing at home right now. Honestly. You guys can make the same um, walnuts milk and be happy at home. Okay. And that's the way it look. Right there. What do you think? Let me know. Let me let Chef Ricardo know what's going on. All right, now. Yeah. So, it's not a lot of milk we get, but I'm still be grateful with it. See, it is. All right. Yeah, man. Look at that, guys. That looks delicious no one can tell me say, that is not a good job chef ricardo has done because that strainer you know you see it that strainer take out everything there's no nothing inside of it it's just clean and nice and delicious okay all right so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna show you how to make a beautiful smoothie from this all right that's what the message all about today now, okay, I've been um, soaking, I've been soaking some blueberry and raspberry right here, okay? <laughs> you say you, you, you're going to put coffee in it. Now, I didn't say I'm going to put coffee in it. I said you can use it to make your coffee tea if you're a person who um, drink coffee. You can use it with coffee. All right. This is the kind of coffee I use. So if you're a person who drink coffee, organic, no cafe, cafe, all right? Yeah, this is organic. So if you're a person who drink coffee and you always I use milk and you're allergic to milk and you want to make yourself some almond milk in it, you can put a, two, a cup of tablespoon in your coffee and drink it, okay? All right. Right here, I got some blueberry. Well, I'm just washing off into some um, baking soda. Yeah, I'll get a cafe that. Cafe. All right, cafe free. Beautiful. So I'm going to show you how you can make a beautiful smoothie from the walnuts milk. All right, guys. Yeah, man. A good vibes in this one. Yeah. So, I'll just get my blender right there. Yeah, man. Get the blender and I 
Excellent. All right. So here it is. All right. We're going to show you exactly how to make this on an amazing blueberry smoothie. Okay. Blueberry and blackberry smoothie. Someone was asking me yesterday about the seeds. Now they go. Mm. Wow. Really nice. My blender, chop up everything. Everything is amazing with the blender. All right? Yeah, everything. Okay, now, we're going to show you how to make a blackberry. Look at this, guys. All right. Um, I love this, man. So this is healthy food. Okay, so I wash it off into some baking soda, guys. All right, yeah, man, baking soda. Oh, yeah, Chef Ricardo. That is what I'm talking about. Okay, um, yeah, man, that looking good. We're not gonna be using any more out of it. See if the rest for tomorrow again for another day. finger of ripe banana inside of it one finger of ripe banana all right Nick what Nicole what's going on with you now yeah soak the walnuts overnight that's the first thing you want to do all right um So I got some, I got some, um, ain't good TV, what's going on? Can't see you at all, man, you disappear. Um, the beautiful, thank you so much. I got some organic oats and it's also vegan. I'm going to put a, a teaspoon inside of it. What baking soda you can google it you know if you don't understand what it's for you can um you can google it you know google it go to google and search for things that you don't understand one teaspoon of oats inside of it a teaspoon I'll put two in it like to because the, the blueberry and the um thing that is very sharp if you want you can put um i got some organic organic honey you can put a teaspoon of organic honey inside of it that's option and then what we're gonna do we're gonna put the, the walnuts milk in it all right so because the walnut, walnut milk is very thick okay what you can do Add a little bit of water to it to dilute it down a little bit. Guys, really thick. Okay, and the, the fruits them gonna be also thick inside of it. Yeah. So you can add a little bit of water to it. Let's add a little bit more walnuts milk. All right, excellent. Yeah, man. But drinking this on his own is very good, guys. Yeah, very very good. So. I would encourage you to give this a try. All right, here it is. Simple. So this right here, you can just put this on your fruits and eat it. Now let's blend this up, guys, and see what's going on. Eat good TV, what's going on? Can't see at all, it disappear. All right, here it is. So we got blackberry, we got blackberry, blueberry, 
oats, banana, um, and the we got the walnut milk in it, a little bit of honey, and we are good to go right there. Okay, yeah, man, a good vibes. Yeah, here's his him. Well, go on, big up yourself every time. All right, so let's blend this up. Here it is. All right, that looks delicious. All right, now I need to um to give it a taste. Okay. All right. Good morning to you, Keith. Thank you so much for coming on the show. We appreciate the love. One hundred percent. Yeah. So we need to give this a try. All right, here it is. Let's go for it right here. Oh yeah. That is delicious. One million percent, guys. Look at that. Okay, yeah man, that looking delicious. What do you think? Delicious and healthy. Definitely 100%. Oh, you use almond milk, make it too. Okay, nice one. Yeah, you can use um, walnuts, you can use almond nut, you can use almond. Yeah. Yeah, but you can't make a pumpkin seed milk. Yeah. But look at that. Excellent. Let's try this. All right, let's give this a try. Yeah. Very smooth and nice. Here's the same one, one. Yeah. Make up, big up yourself every time. Mm. Perfect. Mm. Very healthy and delicious. Here it is. This is the milk. It's very thick and nice. Yeah, man. That's beautiful. Mm -hmm. Sharon, good morning. Big up yourself every time. Mm -hmm. This is very healthy, guys. Let's pour it out into this little container to put it in my fridge. Yeah. Yeah, man. Put that in my fridge. So you see... This right here, guys, you can also, um, put it on your, you know what I mean, your fruits, uh, whatever you want to put it on and just have it. Yeah. You guys can make it at home and it's simple, very, very simple and easy to make. Nothing too complicated. All right. And I will say to you guys, you can use oats, make it oats milk. You can do so much things, guys, at home if you're a person who... Sometimes you just have to just do something healthy. 21, thank you so much. Yeah, appreciate it. 
all right? But I must say thank you so much for your time, and I really appreciate it. We've got a lot more recipes, a lot more ideas will be coming up for you guys. So stay tuned in, tell a friend, and a friend tell a friend. And remember to subscribe because it's important that you don't miss none of my video. All right? Yeah, man. Thank you so much for every subscriber who subscribe. I appreciate you guys. All right? I have some in my fridge also. Brazil nuts. Milk. Okay. Nice one. Yeah, man. You too. Great, big up yourself. Here's just man. Big up yourself, man. And all the other rest of people, them. eat good TV. <laughs> big up yourself every time. I appreciate you guys' love, man. And I'll see you the next time. And I'm out. Bye-bye.